power of AI is transformational in, in every sector of our society. And as we digitize the physical world around us, and the data that comes from that is going to power different insight tools and, and products and capabilities around machine learning and voice capabilities that are going to transform the world of medicine and education and banking. And what's interesting is that you know, we've been using AI for over 30 years. I, mean, I participate in some of it. We've built neural nets around fraud prevention systems going back to, to the 80s. So the world of AI has been around for a long time. It's just the capture of data has is so quantumly increased that unleashing a whole new generation of, of the power of AI is, is a, we're at the dawn of that right now. Our vision and our ambition at RBC is to be one of the best in the world to unlock the potential of this technology to serve our clients from the largest capital markets client to a retail customer to create value and make their lives better. Our approach really recognizes that there's been a shortage, there is a shortage of talent, and a shortage of real key machine learning, reinforcement learning, core AI capability. And, the, and the, the leaders that were best at this tended to want to work together. And they wanted to work together on pure AI research and applied research. And therefore, we recognized early on that we needed a core group and we needed some scale. But we also had to you know, pursue pure and applied research at the same time to attract the best talent that we could. So it was a certain scale, pure, applied, and you need a couple of real thought leaders that would be a magnet to other researchers that came into it. So we, we recognized that the ecosystem had to look like this and we pursued that vision. And I'm really excited to say we've executed on that vision and some of the products you're gonna see as a result of that. When you think about the nature of capital markets and the volatility and the number of variables and the complexity and the interaction of those variables in real time. The capabilities of our reinforcement learning algorithm and, and a artificial intelligence capability plays perfectly into, in real time, learning from a different combination of these variables, different algorithms, changing those algorithms in real time, trying to create value. And the speed with which we can do that and the amount of data we can absorb simultaneously is beyond the capability of an individual or teams of individuals. And therefore, to create these types of, of capabilities for our clients, you can see how it's going to create real differentiated value and performance value, being able to manage that complexity in real time and to learn and train itself before we can re reprogram it. That's where the reinforcement learning capability set in this discipline of AI becomes real. As a society, as we move into this world of, of using AI in different disciplines from medicine to education to, to banking, you know, trust is the foundation. And you know, building trust with uh, your partners and all constituents is mission critical. So how we build this and how we take this journey is really important. And for RBC, this meant working in partnership with our customers, talking about the vision that we had and how we wanted to get there, working with them to build products and test products. It meant working with regulators and bringing regulators along from the beginning and not surprising them at the end that we want to launch a product. And I think for a society, how we build this and how we pace this and how we control the momentum is really important. I think we're, we're proud as an organization how we built our first set of products in this spirit.